Hey everybody, BK here, and I'm actually pretty excited to show you guys this video because never would I thought a Range Rover could have these kind of capabilities in this game. So as you guys can see, we have this lime green colored rough that has been attacking me throughout the whole entire game, and I've had some feature or some uh, my bad past problems with this guy before for no apparent reason he's never given me a reason why he's ramming me you know he, he's been doing this ever since I met him in a lobby and I think it's because um, usually whenever he's winning uh, you know or okay whenever I see him in a lobby he's usually winning he's coming in in first place but whenever I join he's not coming in first place anymore he's coming in second place and so I, I'm, I'm not trying to be this type of guy but I think he's jealous and it's like oh and he's like saying okay if I can't win he can't win and he's just upset or maybe he just wants to do some trolling so uh, as you can see my car's been a little beat up um, that's because of the first lap I guess you know I was like okay I'm just not gonna let him have his way I'm just gonna flip my car a couple of times and just screw around that's exactly what I did so I flipped it and rolled it so my car's all beat up but I'm just giving you guys a good example on why I love this Range Rover because it's big and surprisingly it's fast with all the horsepower I have and I've been trying to you know lighten up my drifting a little bit and sadly this guy kind of bumped into me later on in the video I don't know where it happened but um anyway the, the Range Rover in my opinion it's is big and fast and is durable you know well until you get it sideways going more than 45 miles per hour inside the grass and then you're just gonna die simple as that but Either way, this car is a marvelous car. I love it. And I can't believe how well it's doing with the drifting and dealing with the troll at the same time. Because since it's so big, you know, most people, they just bounce off you depending on where they hit you at. And so that's why it's always nice to have a big car. And so now I'm just trying to give it full throttle just so I can get away from this guy. But then I realize there's no point in trying to hit that corner at a, at a whatever speed because he would just dive bomb me and it would just be terrible. Now then, once again, I don't know why he's been ramming me throughout this whole entire, like, ever since I started playing this game, he, he's been hitting me every time I get into the lobby. And, you know, how lobbies are nowadays, you can't kick anybody out because nobody cares anymore. Nobody cares about kicking somebody unless, unless it's their problem. And that's when the little guy bumped into me. But he looks like a beginner. He doesn't look like he didn't mean to at all, so I'm not going to get mad at him. Christmas noobs, you know. But this guy in this rough has just been ramming me and ramming me and ramming me but surprisingly this Range Rover can hold its own and I think this is the part whenever I started to outrun him inside a a Range Rover no no it's not not yet I, I remember I got him one last time and then surprisingly I was able to outrun him throughout the whole entire race which is kind of incredible for a car this this size and weight and I don't drift most of these corners because I want to save my points and bank them just you know just so that I can have like the slightest chance at winning now this is when I start making my awesome getaway. So, you would think a Porsche, or oh, my bad, a Ruff could catch up with the Range Rover within a matter of seconds, but it's either this guy sucks so bad at drifting and racing that he just has to ram me, and he can't keep up. He he seriously couldn't keep up with his Range Rover. I mean, it's kind of it's kind of sad, but then again, I was happy. And if you guys <laughs> if you guys were in my room, or let's say you guys seen me, um, I had sweat going all through down my sides. And as you can see, I, I'm in second place, and I'm not going to win this race. But I was going crazy. I was sweating. I was getting frustrated, annoyed, because this happened multiple, 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 multiple times inside a lobby. And here I realized there's no way I'm going to win. You know, the, the, the race is practically over. I was about to just say, you know what, screw it, I'm just going to drive, drive the last corner. But, bam! Got first place just by a little over 300 points. And that, that's just because this Range Rover is just so freaking amazing. And he just, oh, it's an R2. Oh, I'm, oh that's not R2, it's an R. It's, a, um, it's rough to R class, wow. But, I just found it extremely pathetic that somebody is ramming me and yet I still come in first place when most likely their goal was to ruin the fun for me but really they made it, they made it more exciting and more you know rushing and I never thought that I would ever get ran inside a lobby and still manage to pull off a win 